activities, let's welcome the Andrew Jackson Elementary School Choir. Phenomenal performance. Let's give them another round of applause. Now, 
at this time, it is our honor to introduce our friend, the Davidson County Clerk, Brenda Wynn, who will serve as our MC this evening. Brenda. Good evening. Wow. What a performance. Let's give the Andrew Jackson Elementary School Choir another big round of applause. I mean, those guys had the clapping and the rocking and the beat really going on. So thank you guys so much. Good evening. It is my pleasure to welcome everyone to Nashville's Public Square for the 2023 Mayor's Tree Lighting Ceremony. Thank you all so much for sharing this moment with us and for helping us ring in the holiday season. I'm Brenda Wynn, Davidson County Clerk, and I'm thrilled to serve again as MC. This is my ninth year. Um, I hope they'll have me back at least one more. Uh, and, and I am excited to be the MC for this year's Mayor's Tree Lighting Ceremony. Before I introduce our next guest, I want to make sure everyone knows that we have hot chocolate and treats in the tents located on the lawn area right over to my left, probably your right. The holiday refreshments are, you're enjoying were once again donated by the incredibly generous members of the district, a nonprofit organization working to preserve Broadway, Second Avenue, and Printer's Alley. The district's board of directors have provided the cookies. So let's thank them. Also, I want to say thanks to everyone who has donated an, an unwrapped toy for the Metro Nashville Police Department's Christmas Basket Program, which is a 60-year tradition of officers delivering food baskets and toys to Nashville families on Christmas Eve. We've got more great music coming your way, but first, it's my pleasure to introduce our next guest speaker. Vice Mayor Angie Henderson is a native Nashvillian, a wife, mother, a fundraising and marketing professional, former councilwoman representing District 34, Mayor, Vice Mayor Henderson's commitment to public service has spanned almost a decade with no signs of slowing down. So please help me welcome to the stage Vice Mayor Angie Henderson. Hey there, everybody. Happy holidays to you all. Merry Christmas and welcome. I'm so excited to be here with you tonight, but also with all my colleagues from the Metro Council. So I am here representing your city council. Here we are in the civic heart of our city to light this beautiful tree. And I just wanted to express our gratitude and appreciation to you all as your council members, 40 members strong all across the city with great holiday events happening in our neighborhoods and uh, with our small businesses all over the city. So get out there around Nashville, meet your neighbors. I'm so glad you're here and thank you for being here. All right, thanks to Vice Mayor Henderson. And now coming to the stage is a singer and actress, Grace Lear from Hallmark's Time for Her to Come Home for Christmas. Help me welcome Grace to the stage. Check, check. Thank you so much. I thought I would sing an original Christmas song of mine that's featured in my Hallmark movie. It's called Star on Top of the Tree. And it's about what Christmas is all about, which is being with the ones that you love. So thank you for being here tonight. This is Star on Top of the Tree. Snow globe sitting on the mantle, wreaths hanging on the door. Red and green sweaters and flannels and eggnog being poured. That old mistletoe lights hung up, stockings in a row, but that's all just a star on top of the tree, the bow on top of the gift. It's friends and family that make Christmas what it is. It's the laughter and love, all you need to believe. And all the rest is just a star on top of the tree. 
tree. Smell of cookie dough and flower Santa's almost here. A fireplace mixed with snow showers. It's the best time of the year. Caroling and roast chestnuts, sleigh bells ring, but that's all just the straw on top of the tree, the bow on top of the gift. It's friends and family that make Christmas what it is. It's the laughter and love, all you need to believe, and all the rest is just the star on top of the tree. The star on top of the tree. The star. Tone lights hung up, stockings in a row, but that's all just the star on top of the tree, the bow on top of the gift. It's friends and family that make Christmas what it is. It's the laughter and love, all you need to believe. And the rest is just the star on top of the tree. The star on top of the tree. The star on top of the tree. Oh my, what a beautiful song. Thank you so much, Grace. All right, one more round of applause for Grace Lear. Now, we would like to recognize each sponsor and all the participants and tree donors. So, we want to first thank David and Sherry Caldwell. They graciously donated this glorious tree. And although they couldn't be here this evening, their son Bennett is here. Bennett, where are you? There he is back there. Bennett's waving. Thank you, Bennett, and tell your, tell your parents we said thank you so much. Next, we want to thank the following Metro Parks and Recreation, and I want to put a special emphasis on Parks and Recreation because they do uh, a lot of work to help bring all of this together. So special thanks to Park to Andrew Jackson, Elementary School Choir. Thank you guys so much. You were fabulous. Grace Lear, Nashville Department of Transportation, Metro General Services, Metro Water Services. A special thank you to Nashville Electric Service, the District Nashville and Nashville Downtown Partnership, Scott Wallace, Hugh Bennett. And where are those guys? Oh, they're standing over here behind me. t rack Where's t rack <laughs> Booster. Where's Booster? <laughs> Nash. Where's Nash? There he is back there. Sheriff. Socket. We're socket. And Tempo. Last but not least, Tempo. Now, and we can't forget Santa. Where's Santa Claus? Where's Santa? All right. Well, let's give everyone another round of applause. And now I want to bring to the stage, without further ado, our mayor, Freddie O'Connell. Help me welcome Freddie. All right, everybody, it is basically the moment we've all been waiting for. Thank you, Madam Clerk. Hello, everybody. Good evening. Happy December. Uh, welcome to Historic Public Square and to Nashville's 24th annual Christmas tree lighting ceremony. I'm delighted to be here with you. Uh, so many of you who are here tonight have helped support the Metro Nashville Police Department's Christmas Basket Program, which started with two families in 1961 and is making the rounds on Christmas Eve again this year. Our care for each other is one of the things that makes Nashville great. And I am so lucky to be able to come into an office every day and see it there with our team, uh, see it all around the city and the places I go, and see it right here, right now, with the people that have gathered tonight for a great community event. I am so grateful to live in a city like that and to have the amazing, incredible opportunity to lead a city like that. 
I don't ever want to take it for granted, and I hope none of you do either, because it's special and it is part of our story. And trees have stories, too. Uh, this tree tonight that we will be lighting is a Norway spruce, approximately 30 feet tall. Uh, Bennett Caldwell and his family have donated this tree. Bennett helped his dad plant the tree in their yard when he was two years old. And now it is here to help us tell the story of the season. To me, this is more than a tree. It is a story of family. It is a story of growing in Nashville. It is a symbol of hope and resilience, of strength and life. It towers above the historic ground here at the foot of Diane Nash Plaza, bearing witness to the power of peace and the promise of a better tomorrow. It's also bearing about 5,500 multicolored lights, and we're gonna ask our young people here tonight to help us turn those on in just a second. But before we do, I would like to take a moment uh, <clears throat> to reflect and remember I want to dedicate uh, this occasion to a friend of mine, because this is the first Christmas I will be celebrating without him, uh, Father Charlie Strobel, who was founder of Room in the End, friend of the homeless and inspiration to all of us. He passed away in August, but uh, his spirit is with us today. He is the light that never fades, and we must never let his memory fade. Uh, if you all would join me for just a moment of silence in his recognition uh, and recognition of the Nashvillians uh, that we remember that have carried us to this point in our lives. Thank you for joining me in that. Now, in his honor, on behalf of the Metropolitan Government of Nashville and Davidson County and all of its employees, we wish you and your families a very Merry Christmas. Now, this is where I need some help. I need any family with children in the audience to come right up front here. Anybody who's not up front, don't be shy. We have mascots who can help guide you to the locations. All right, now how many of our folks up here know how to count? Can anybody count down from 10? Anybody know the number 10? Show of hands, yeah. 10, we're gonna go from 10 down to one. We'll wait for you to get here. And I'm gonna let Brenda take over the final moment. Yeah, here we go. You're going down with him? Yeah, well, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna okay, all right. All right, our mayor's gonna go down. And we're gonna, if there's any other young person who wants to help us do this, we really do want you here. Please come down. There we go. All right. I want to thank Mayor O'Connell for those very incredible words. And I want to thank all of you again for spending some time with us this evening. All right. Now, can you all guess what time it is? Can anybody guess what time it is? It's tree lighting time. Okay. All right. Well, it's time to light up this very beautiful tree. So I need you guys to count down with me. Can you start at 10? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wow, what a gorgeous tree. Oh, my goodness. Let's give one more round of applause to the Bennett family. This wouldn't have happened without them. So thank you, Bennett family, for donating this incredible tree. We want to thank Metro Parks and Recreation and NES for the installation. Once again, thanks to everyone who donated an unwrapped toy for the Metro Police Department's Christmas Basket Program. And now, well, everybody... That's the end of our program. Thank you all for coming out and joining us this evening. Feel free to enjoy more refreshments from the district, the National Downtown Partnership. Please drive safely as you find your way home. And on behalf of the Metropolitan Government of Nashville, we want to wish you all a very happy holiday season. Thank you so much.
This has been a service of the Metro Nashville Network. If you would like to see this presentation again or for more information on this and other programs, visit nashville.gov.